The next technique we're going to look at is reverse hammer lock. Now reverse hammer lock is for a hammer lock from behind. The difference is, is it's in a cross arm grab rather than a straight arm grab. In passing the horizon, for example, that's a straight arm uh, hammer lock. In this case, they're using a right left grab to your right arm, so it's a cross arm grab. So you can't get the same uh, at reaction that you're looking for as you would in passing the horizon. So in this case, on the A version, they're right on top of you like this. So we're going to step forward as we counter grab. We're going to step to a soft bow, elbow is cocked at shoulder level, and we're going to pivot the horse as we break their elbow, and then hammer fist the groin. Big in. We got to set a hammer lock. We counter grab as we step forward. Now you want to step to about 12 o'clock, but it could be either direction slightly. It doesn't have to be exactly 12. Soft bow. Left hand cocked at shoulder level, elbow as we pivot the horse, watching your opponent, and then fist the groin. One more time on A. And hammer fist the groin. Now the B variation to this is identical. The only difference is, is they're at arm's length. So B, B is for back. We step back into them and do the exact same motion. Okay, again. The B version, counter grab, step back to about the 430 position, break, and hammer fist. So A is forward, B is back. So let's do these one more time from this angle. The A version, step forward, and hammer fist. The B version, step back, and hammer fist. Okay, from this angle. So the A, the guys. The hammer lock, we step forward to about 10, 30, 12 o'clock, elbow, hammer fist. Again, break, hammer fist. The B version, same thing, but step back. Okay, one last time. And that's reversing hammer lock, A and B. So, the A version, they're on top of you. And what we're going to do is we're going to step out and counter grab. And as we step out and counter grab, we're going to set our arm up to drive right above the elbow to break, then hammer fist the groin, back fist the face. Again, they grab into a hammer lock. We step out and counter grab the hand. Break the arm, hammer fist the groin, and that's all there is. Again, break, hammer fist. Now, the only difference between A and B is B, we're at a distance. So maybe they've got their arm on their shoulder, but there's some space between you. So stepping out really won't work. So we're going to step in and break the elbow, hammer fist, the groin. Again, they counter grab. We step out, we break, we hammer fist. One last time. Counter grab. Two. That's called reverse hammerlock.